Hi, my name is Jonathan Pickup. Welcome to my podcast 118. I want to talk to you about extruding objects with Vectorworks 2010. Now normally when you extrude objects, the extrusion is based on the view that you're in. So if I select an object or I create a rectangle in Vectorworks, we have the ability to control the plane. Now this is part of the Vectorworks 2010 planar graphics. We can make it the layer plane or the screen plane. And there is a default setting up here that you can uh, use so that everything you create is either on the active layer plane or on the screen plane. So what's the difference between layer plane and screen plane? If we change to a 3D view, this object is on the layer plane, this object is on the screen plane. And you notice that this one's changed and so it looks like in 3D it's lying flat on the ground. If I extrude this object, Let's give it a decent height. You don't see a difference. What's happened? Well, it's extruded towards your eye because it's based on the screen plane. This object that's based on the layer plane, when I extrude it, it starts at zero on the working plane and goes up. So if you use layer plane for your objects, you don't have to worry so much about your view. Of course, if you do want to extrude it in a certain angle, you do have to make sure that your object is set to screen plane rather than layer plane. So if you want to extrude something off here coming out, then it would pay you to that object would pay you to make sure that on the object info palette it says screen plane, not layer plane. Hey, thanks for watching. This is my website, arconcad.co.nz. You're going to find lots of manuals and I do a lot of online training too.